Hi, it's Dwight here, and I'm going to go over how to go ahead and print your labels for your sample boxes. And it's really pretty straightforward. First thing you're going to do is you open up your PayPal, and you're going to see your orders here. You'll see the money's come in, and you're going to say print shipping labels. So you just go ahead and you click on that on that button right there. And you're going to come to a page like this, and this is really very straightforward. All you need to do is come down here, you check, you make sure everything's being sent to where you need it to go. Your shipping address is right here, and it's already supplied for you. Then it's just a matter of coming down here, select the type of service you want. You're going to choose Priority Mail, one to three days. And then here, you're just going to put Flat Rate box small box so you click on here and you put the mailing date and then all you need to do is hit continue you hit the continue button here and then it will go ahead and it will take you it will go ahead let me just do that Let's hit continue it brings it up here and when you hit the pay and continue right here it will go ahead and it will take the 525 as you can see here it's 525 it will take it right out of your PayPal account and then when it goes to the next page all you have to do is print it and when you print it it will come right out on your computer and all you have to do is cut, cut it and glue it to the box okay once you print it this is what it's gonna look like and all you need to do what I do is I just go ahead and cut this out right here and you use a glue stick and you just glue it right to the priority mailbox and it's and once it's glued it's ready to go keep this section for your personal records and it's done now you just go ahead and go to the post office and drop it off the postage is paid for and you just save 60 cents in the process by doing it on the internet now you can also go to the US post office which is usps.com uh, open up an account and here it's exactly the same thing you just put in the information so here you can put in the information and send out a box so if you want to send out a box to somebody you know or let's say you don't have their their mailing address is not in the, in the PayPal account then you can just send it out directly here or if you're doing it for a team member let's say one of your team members calls you and says you know they want you to send out a package for them this is the way to do it and again it's real simple you, you just fill in the information and right here it says flat rate you just check on the flat rate and then it will come down here and you just go ahead and select package and it will calculate everything and it will take you right over to a page and you can go ahead and just print out your label just like the one that I just shared with you. Uh, that's all there is to it. Um, just to, so you can take a look at something. Now here's the letter that I use that I put in now what that I put into the box. Now the letter has two sides to it and what I've done here is I made this insert where I can fold it and I want you to take a look right here what I do is I fold it right here along these two lines and I create a little book in and then there's information here and there's how to take so everything is included here then I go ahead and put my name and e email address and phone number right in here so when they can contact me they have information to get a hold of me and then on the other side of this Here's more information about rain. Now, this gets folded. It looks like a little book. And here's what it looks like when. Let me just. Uh, and here's what it looks like when it goes in the box. Now, this is the small box. I use this on. I, now, I use cardstock. So, you, it's a little heavier. And I just fold it right along those lines. You can see right here. And so, when the box is open this is the first thing a person sees and then I take the seven packets and I put it right in between you know, in, in between the two sheets here and then they open up so no matter how they open the box up when it opens up even if they tear it off from the top there will be some information how to do it but if they go ahead and just pull this out it will open up and the first thing they'll see when they pull this out here's the instructions and how to use it a little information 
and then if they take a look at the inside here's 27 reasons to drink soul uh, I will include in right below this video a link that you can go that you, you can download this and use it for yourself and you can make any adjustments you want um, I use Microsoft Publisher to put this together you can gives you just kind of a basic idea or you can just go ahead and copy here the main thing that when you do that just make sure you don't forget to put your your name and email address right there and that's it it's very simple so you just go to your PayPal when they place the order you go ahead and print the label and PayPal will, will walk you through it step by step or if you need to just go ahead and go to the US post office and just go ahead and set up an account and remember the boxes are free you can set up the account free and then you can print this uh, right on your computer you go ahead and you just cut those labels out and you get some glue sticks and glue it out right onto the box and you're ready to go and the person will get a very will get their seven packets they'll get your information and the, if you do the informational brochure like I've done here um, yeah it slides right in. Uh, one of the things I did do to make sure it fits very well is I did take and I when I print this off I just trim a quarter inch off the side and then when you fold it in it just slides right in the box so you can take your seven packets and put it in between the two sheets and just slide it right in there and it's done sealed up and it's ready to go alright hope that helps I know a few of you have been asking questions on it so I decided to go ahead and do this video to help you guys out and again the link down below will have the sample of what I'm using so if you have any additional questions you know just give me a call bye now